whole big three stuff was going on for over a decade, this verse cements to me that you were just excited to be in that conversation. You didn't care about the placement, and for a long time, the fans never asserted a placement on anybody. It was What's up, everybody, and welcome back to another episode. Please like the video and subscribe. Our target is only a thousand likes. So, J. Cole has weighed in on the high profile Drake and Kendrick Lamar feud on his surprising single, Port Antonio. Back in April, Kendrick Lamar and Drake went head to head in a skating rap battle after Kendrick Lamar called out Drake and Cole on Future and Metro Boomings like that. Then, J. Cole did originally reply with a seven minute drill on the mixtape Might Delete Later, but retracted the diss track and apologized swiftly after. So, J. Cole defended his decision to step back from the conflict on a five minute track. In the song, he talks about several things. He talked about the allegations Drake and Kendrick Lamar exchanged in their respective diss songs. He then talked about the use of bots on social media, then directly mentions Drake. Whole big three stuff was going on for over a decade. This verse cements to me that you were just excited to be in that conversation. You didn't care about the placement and for a long time the fans never asserted a placement on anybody it was kind of just a thing that was known or not known the big three is drake kendrick j cole mm -hmm. so now this verse to me just says all right cole was perfectly fine with that framing of things mm -hmm. i think that it was a little naive to think that the other two felt the same way they clearly did not. At no point at the mention of the big three did the other two ever feel like, yo, that's dope, all three of us is the big three. <laughs> okay. No one wanted to be bronze. No, I'm just saying, but okay. Okay, yeah, but that fits Cole said he didn't want to be bronze. Yeah, but that fits who that he fits, is, yeah, though. fits who he is. Or who bronze? he's shown us Damn. to be. <laughs> I mean, he's no, just humble. I'm talking about like, yo, j just the fact that I'm mentioned with yeah. the two best dudes in the game. Humbleness. And I'm in that conversation yes. is an accolade in itself to me. Okay, at, 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 cool for him. But the people that were arguing on J. Cole's behalf in that top three conversation. Which he didn't that, ask for. That what, okay, I'm not talking about that. I'm just okay. talking about what, what has gone on. Okay, go ahead. They were never saying, yo, that's dope that Cole is involved in that. They were saying, Cole's number one. Okay. And Cole. in his raps, he was also saying he that was he number one. That was my next that point. That was Cole okay. saying, I want to be, I am going to be number I one. I want all the smoke. Uh, yeah. But before he got on that... His fans and wait, were saying, and, but wait, and yeah, but I don't give a fuck about that. I, I care. I'm talking to your your the heart of MCs now. Like, so you could try to paint this away for fans talking about niggas do niggas is doing this for the bots. mean people and the bots and that other side of hip hop. We not on that side, dog. We not on that side. Before that side was really a thing, those other two in the big three wanted to kill each other and fight for number one. And you presented yourself as someone that wanted to do the same. So you could still rap great. This is incredible rapping. Mm -hmm. But also to be number one, you got to maybe take somebody head off or do something that is not going to feel the greatest. It got to be a competitive thing at some and, point. And I think that he looked at it and, then, and after this, especially, he got some reflection and said, yo, the risk mm -hmm. is not worth the reward. I also have it. a retort to that. I he think that you could also become number one by ignoring all that shit and just killing shit and pushing forward. No, I but I agree. Can't, when you I keep going back, they can't do that. It's, I agree. Fuck as the long, internet, as long man. As somebody else true. ain't up That's is true. Fuck the internet. Yo, no. ISO won that. That ain't said enough. Fuck the internet. Stop that's reading the comments, man. Bro, that's not that true. was my point. That's true. I don't it's think critical. That's when, when you are elite, features. fuck the internet. Yeah. That's how it's we true. got certain features. That was true. my whole point. As a Cole fan, bro, fuck what the niggas who aren't your real fans are saying. Rap for you and for your fans. You're rapping to please. You can't please everybody. And the sooner he realized that, the better off he'll be. And he just said that in this now. And I think the realization came after this shit. He's saying, yo, now I realize you can't please everybody. You should have realized that Wait. months ago. That's not All for right. you to say. Yo, that's for, for him to come out to that there, in real time. For anybody out there that's listening, yo, maybe you never heard it before. You can't please everybody. True. Why you gotta be sarcastic? That's the whole reason no, his I'm fan not base being was sarcastic. Worse. That's a true we, thing. We, we but don't get that. on no fucking song as uh, he ain't no uh, uh, young hush puppy. Don't get on the song and now tell me 
I learned after this you can't please everybody. Nigga, knock it off. That's, you, that's not what you was on. That's, just yeah, that's not I'm what not you was on. That's not what you was on. That's not what you was on. Even even in that seven minute drill record that he put out that he deleted, he was talking like I can take your fucking heads off. Kendrick, I, I, I'm better than you. I'm better now. Is I'm just glad to be here. I think. I think. I, I think, don't want to hear that shit. Bro. I think he got a hold. Of, I think he got a hold of what Kendrick was going to talk about when he was going to call Drake. You know, or, or the it didn't have to go. The there. news that he called Drake the pedophile and all that shit. I think Cole got a win of that and just said, "I'm removing myself from that." That shit. Yeah, we be messy. We being funny. And, and you know what I'm mad at too. And then I'll toss back to you, Ish. If I'm Kendrick. Don't get on no song making it sound like I was the one whose emotions was ever in jeopardy by none of this shit. I've been consistent in my point since that Big Sean shit. What is it, control? Control. Mm -hmm. control. I want to kill all you niggas, whether we friendly or not. That has been my position. It ain't me. So now that makes it sound like this is some type of Drake public pandering, and then we get to an eight-bar solo of Drake... Public pandering. Fiend and wait, and, but wait, and yeah, but I don't give a fuck about that. I, I can't. I'm talking to your your the heart of MCs now. Like, so you could try to paint this away for fans talking about niggas do niggas is doing this for the bots. mean people and the bots and that other side of hip hop. We're not on that side, dog. We're not on that side. Before that side was really a thing, those other two in the big three wanted to kill each other and fight for number one. And you presented yourself as someone that wanted to do the same. So you could still rap great. This is incredible rapping. Mm -hmm. But also to be number one, you got to maybe take somebody head off or do something that is not going to feel the greatest. It got to be a competitive thing at some and, point. And I think that he looked at it and then, and after this, especially, he got some reflection and said, yo, the risk mm -hmm. is not worth the reward. I also work. have a retort to that. I he think did. he could also become number one by ignoring all that shit and just killing shit and pushing forward. No, I but think I you keep, when you I keep going back, I'll fucking that. do that. It's, I agree. Fuck as the long, internet, As long man. as somebody that's else ain't up there. Yes, it's true. Fuck the internet. Yo, no. ISO won that. That ain't said enough. Fuck the internet. Stop that's reading not, the comments, man. Bro, that's not true. That was my point. That's true. I don't think. That, that's when, when you are elite, features. fuck the internet. Yeah. That's, that's how true. we got certain features. That was true. my whole point. As a Cole fan, bro, fuck what the niggas who aren't your real fans are saying. Rap for you and for your fans. You're rapping to please. You can't please everybody. And the sooner he realized that, the better off he'll be. And he just said that in this now. And I think the realization came after this shit. He's saying, yo, now I realize you can't please everybody. You should have realized that Wait. months ago. That's not All for right. you to say. Yo, that's for, for him to come out to there, that in real time. For anybody out there that's listening, yo, maybe you never heard it before. You can't please everybody. True. Why are you gonna be sarcastic? That's the whole reason no, his I'm fan not base being was sarcastic. Worse. That's a true we, thing. We, but we don't get on that. no fucking song as uh he ain't no uh, uh young hush puppy. Don't get on the song and now tell me. I learned after this you can't please everybody. Nigga, knock it off. That's, you, just that's words. not what you was on. That's just Man, yeah, that's I'm not what not you was on. That's not, what you was on. that's not what you was on. That's not what you was on. Even even in that seven minute drill record that he put out that he deleted, he was talking like I can take your fucking heads off. Kendrick, I, I, I'm better than you. I'm better now. Is I'm just glad to be here. I think. I think. I, I think, don't want to hear that shit. Bro. I think he got a hold. Of, I think he got a hold of what Kendrick was going to talk about when he was going to call Drake. You know, or, or the it didn't have to go. The there. news that he called Drake a pedophile and all that shit. I think Cole got a win of that and just said, I'm removing myself from that. That shit's yeah, about we to get messy. We being funny. And, and you know what I'm mad at too? And then I'll toss right to you, Ish. If I'm Kendrick, don't get on no song making it sound like I was the one whose emotions was ever in jeopardy by none of this shit. I've been consistent in my point since that Big Sean shit. What is it, control? Control. Control. Mm -hmm. control. I want to kill all you niggas, whether we friendly or not. That has been my position. It ain't me. So now that makes it sound like this is some type of Drake public pandering. And then we get to an eight bar solo of Drake public pandering. Where you are addressing what? I don't want to say Internet narratives because somebody might really feel like this. See, we be saying shit is an Internet narrative. When niggas might really be feeling away and the internet just happened to notice. It's possible. Could be. That's another thing mm -hmm. in 2025 yeah. that need to go. Internet narratives. 
I'm sick of that. It's over for that. Niggas be feeling away. And the internet sees it. <laughs> I don't think this is him. J. Cole's never come off that way to me as the guy to reply to internet narratives. 